greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov slash apod. And today's picture for July the 6th of 2021. Well, it is titled Saturn and six moons. So what do we see here? Well, towards the center, we do see the planet Saturn uh, with its distinct rings that we can see. And in fact, you can actually see a gap between the rings there, which is actually caused by some of the moons that we see in our image today. And the moons will use their gravity to shape the rings of Saturn. So many of the patterns that we see within the rings are caused by the moons themselves. And we can also see structures on Saturn, some lighter and darker bands on the planet as well in the atmosphere of the planet. Now primarily what we're looking at here are the moons of Saturn and in fact six of them are visible here and four of those are in very close and you really can't easily distinguish between which one is which they're all kind of jumbled together uh, in various images taken at different points within their orbit. But the outer two that we can see here are a little bit easier to identify and they are labeled here for you and you can see the large moon Titan uh, is going around in fact showing almost a complete orbit around Saturn and we can see those different images as they were taken ar around there as Saturn orbits or sorry as Titan orbits around Saturn. Now the other moon that we see is Iapetus and that is another one of Saturn's moons and it has a very very large orbit so we're only seeing por a portion of that orbit that was actually able to be imaged here. So you can see those ones as they travel off much further away from Saturn. So the moons are in various orbits and in fact Saturn has over 80 moons that have now been identified. So when we consider that our planet has one moon, this the larger pl planets in the outer part of the solar system have a much greater numbers of moon of moons such as things like Saturn here having not pushing 100 uh, moons around it. Now that doesn't mean they're all very large. Titan is a very large moon uh, comparable in size to our moon here around Earth. But most of the other moons are relatively small around Saturn. So it doesn't have any other really large moons. And in fact, Iapetus is the third of largest of its moons. And you can get an idea of its size just kind of by looking at this here and comparing to what you what you see in terms of the brightness. You can get an idea that uh, Titan is a bit brighter and therefore probably a bit larger than Saturn. So you can get a little bit of an idea of that although that also doesn't take into account how reflective they are a reflective object will reflect more light and may appear somewhat brighter so we can see that uh, in the image here today so that was our picture of the day for July the 6th of 2021 it was titled Saturn and six moons we'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be through Orion so we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.